All right, so for today's video, we're going to be looking at the Shame on You podcast, where it looks like Duno exposes some of the underlying inner beef that's going on between the co-hosts. No, no, you guys had something when we were at the other spot and decided Duno wasn't a part of the gang. Mm. Mm. I mean, to be fair. And I think like... what you're going to see is that Duno really doesn't like t Rel. And it's going to show through. It's going to become exposed. I mean, it was clear to me immediately that Duno's been bottling this up and he just couldn't wait to get on the air to air this out. He doesn't like t -Rell. And it just gets really juicy. There's a lot of passive aggressiveness that materializes in this piece. So it's like this clashing of the egos and the power. And the this is unscripted, uncut, raw aggression that we're going to be watching right now. So let's get to this first clip. So this is where Duno brings up in the conversation and makes a point to make it clear to everyone that he's not going to both live shows. He's only going to go to one live show because he's got other plans. If you can believe it, watch this. <laughs> Are we guessing? Like a motherfucker. Are you guys doing topics tomorrow? Or are you guys are just like vibing out? Yeah, we vibe. We ain't doing no Damn, topics. Damn, he said, y'all. <laughs> yeah, yeah. No, I'll probably go tomorrow and not go Saturday. You gonna go tomorrow? Damn, you both yeah, well, go, go tomorrow? No, you can go tomorrow. Go ahead. Yeah. I don't you know. Now, did you see how he just brought it up uh, out of the blue? So you guys doing uh, topics or what? Like, he, he wants to make it clear. And he wants to bring it up because he knows it's going to upset everyone. <laughs> are we saying? guessing like a motherfucker? Are you guys doing topics tomorrow? Or are you guys are just nah, like vibing? He said, y'all. Yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah. Uh, yeah. Do not no, don't get the cup, no, no. That's why we left you off, bro. You always too busy for us, man. Right. No, no. You guys had something when we were at the other spot and decided Duna wasn't a part of the gang. Mm. I mean, to be fair, you was so like, basically, Duno is saying that he's not going to the live show because it's out of spite because they left him out of something. And also because Duno uh, discovered the flyer for the live show didn't have Duno's face on it. And apparently Duno wanted his face to be on that flyer and it wasn't. So he became offended and now he's out for revenge. As you can see, he's calling people out and everything else. And he's doing this also as a uh, revenge because t Rell called him out last show. So let's get to this next uh, clip. I mean, to be fair, you was like, nah, you was like, ah, I'm about to do my thing with brown bag and I ain't, I ain't tripping on y'all. Yeah, no, you know no, I mean? I'm, I'm, I'm it was like that. Though, it was like that. It you was chose them. You chose your then side. Then you was like, you know what? I don't want to do radio anymore. No, no you, that's I'm a fat bitch. I just want to just. You call him a fat and bitch. And just podcast or shame on you. You and definitely. That's what you definitely All right, so as you can see, everyone's ganging up on Duno, and Duno's going to feel like he's getting backed into a corner, and then something's going to happen to where it becomes exposed that Duno secretly hates these guys. Got out of there on his dog. Is it like, I, I feel like, I feel like, I feel like I have two parents and every time I go to each house, it's like, <laughs> I, I gotta hear about the other one. And then I gotta come oh, so they be complaining about us? They definitely be like, oh, so who is it? Like, I think Letty asked me like if they were drowning, if you and her were drowning. And I was like, I hope T-Real, he got one on her. Damn, Damn, why she got beef bro. with me? But then you, you made me do the same thing last one. No, I didn't. Technically. Technically. I didn't know. I didn't. See? Revenge for last pod. Ooh, Duno's getting even once again. He's doing... See, it's all spite. He's doing this to spite them because he thinks he's the the, the big shot. Now, I want to point out that Duno brings up t uh defective arm a lot, and it's getting to the point where it's excessive. We've already called out Duno for his excessive use of the word Heather, I think we're going to have to call him out and say, shut the fuck up about the arm. It's not funny anymore. I personally believe that Duno keeps bringing up the arm as a way to lower t Rell to pull him down. You know what I mean? To point out his inequities and his, uh, his shortcomings. It's sort of a slimy strategy, if you ask me, but let's take a look at this next clip. This is where Duno uh, basically makes a racist joke about the version of Happy Birthday song that they sang at T-Rail's birthday party. Apparently, Duno had never heard that version of the song sung before, and so he made some comments, and then AD calls him out and says, hey, if you don't know that version, you must not have any black friends. You must not know anything about us. And tensions rise, and you can see it. Watch, watch this. But I've never, I've never heard that version. So when they start singing, Damn. what did you do? No, 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 because all right, we say happy birthday, regular you know, shit. You know what okay. that lets me know? What? You ain't got a lot of black friends like that, dude. Damn, dog. That don't fucking matter. Y'all have black friends now, and it was cool to see. But I've only really <laughs> seen it. 
<laughs> but look, so T-Rail. No, 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 look, look, I was sitting there. All right, so this is where they really start arguing. T-Rail is going to start really calling Duno out. And I think T-Rail's anger comes from the sort of the rivalry that's going on between the Brown Bag podcast and the Shame on You podcast. But what I don't understand is the rivalry comes from Duno. Duno is the cause of the rivalry. And because Duno obviously favors the uh, Brown Bag podcast, I think he just needs to make a decision and just go over there permanently and uh, let MacWap come on over uh, to the shame on you. So this is where T-Rail actually starts calling out Duno uh, for being a wobbler. Let's uh, let's run that right now. Man, fuck T-Rail, he's a bitch. But you, you, uh, you just start out the conversation. I, I work hard. I, I, I love this. No, he I work hard. He took, like, hey, what? Bro, you, you, bro, you did. Stop taking his side. You're such a kiss ass, bro. No, bro. You're such, I'm no, bro. Suck your cock, no, bro. Oh, this you is did. a real no, argument. You did. Oh, He's such a bro, kiss ass. If the nigga give you some constructive criticism, so why it ain't the end it? of the world. No, this is what he said. Can we talk about it? Can we talk about it? We can talk about it. Okay, let's talk about it. He said. He said, every time I tell you something, you shrug it off or you don't pay. And I'm like, and I'm like, what are you talking about? I'm like, bro, I've been focused. Oh, so Duno has exposed to some inner beef. Let's hear some more of that. And then I gave it. And then I'm like, by the end of the day, I'm going to have you some. And I sent him a couple of things. And he's like, okay. So I replied, instead of being like, good job, Duno. He just I asked you about vlogs and you went into this whole rant. And like, no, that's like, not why. We could ask AD. He right here. We went into this whole rant as if. You don't work hard, you know what I'm saying? That's like, not you like you like you no. not dedicated. I said, hold on, we we not lefty. We not telling you that. Why do you keep bringing up lefty? That's what they that's what they telling you over there at Brown Bag, dog. Don't Who's telling that. me that, bro? <laughs> you, bro, <laughs> it did it did it did go from that to lefty. like. Ugh. I was no, like, no, no, no. All right, so I do believe that the co-hosts, not do know, but the shame on you uh, co-hosts, are sending shots at the Brown Bag now. So that's very interesting as well. They're going to continue to fight. When's the last time you told AD something about the pod, about Fig Mini World? Um, yeah, of, come a, on. A lot of time. When? What? When? Give me one. When? Give me one. Because, when? Because, when? because, because you, you could point out when he shrugged <laughs> off. You were giving me a vlog idea. Tell me when he yeah, shrugged you off and I, didn't pay attention. Not even a, a, a vlog idea. No, you said Wait, 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 wait. No, 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 no. This is, this is the, okay. No, no, hold on, hold on, hold on. This is, this is the thing. He's talking about putting more effort in. So just like... Did you see how Duno just like stuck his finger in T-Rail's face and disrespectfully says, no, let him talk? That's very, that's out of line. No, yeah. no, no, no. This okay, is, this is the, okay. No, no, hold on, hold on, hold on. No, this, is, this is the thing. He's talking about... All right, let's continue on. Now, don't think T-Rail didn't notice that also and uh, made a mental note, but he's a cool guy. He can keep his cool under pressure. He's not going to come unhinged and fly off the handle, but uh, that point was out of line. And it will come back to bite Duno. Keep it gangster. What I'm saying? Nothing. Yeah, okay. that's fucked up. <laughs> <laughs> but what I'm saying is. Okay, okay, look, because it's a vlog, it's just because you're Hispanic. This is Fig Muni World. Mm -hmm. And the world part we want to incorporate. And I want to incorporate some of the Hispanic culture into our channel. And I want to get the ideas from you. And I said, I brought up a few ideas. And you like, just shrugged it off. And you like, nigga, that's probably nasty. So now. I just want, you know what I'm saying, your ideas and you know what I'm saying. You, you didn't word it like that though. If you would have worded that, bro, no, you did it. See, there you go. Go take more, a side. No, go it's not side. taking. Like, listen, yeah, you are, bro. It's not taking side, bro. Listen, we want this motherfucker to be big. Everybody got to pull their motherfucking weight to make this shit shake. At 100%. the end of the day, hey. do I pull my weight? Fuck y'all. <laughs> I don't worry about it. Fuck. So we've even got AD lecturing uh, everyone about how to make it work and everything. So this is bad. Uh, there's a lot of turmoil going on. I hope this video was able to make that clear for you. And I'll see you on the next one.